Hi guys, in the last video we have seen the introduction of consignment account. Okay, now in this video we are going to solve a problem on consignment. Okay, here it is said that Mahesh of Mumbai consigned goods of the cost of rupees 20,000 to Balaram of Bangalore. Okay, so Mahesh has sent goods to Balaram of costing rupees 20,000. Okay, so Mahesh is the consigner and Balaram is the consignee. Okay, then it is said the consigner paid freight of rupees 1000 and insurance of rupees 500. Okay, so Mahesh has incurred some expenses to send the goods to the consignee. Okay, and received an advance of rupees 10,000 by check from Balaram. Okay, so Balaram has paid an advance to Mahesh of 10,000 okay all right then it is said the consignee paid carriage of rupees 300 and octroi of rupees 200 okay so Balaram also has incurred some expenses to receive the goods okay then it is said he sold all the goods for rupees 30,000 and sent an account sales okay so he sold the goods he sold all the goods okay and sent an account sales account sales is a statement containing all the information of what consignee did how much good he received okay how much he sold and how much commission he charged etc etc all right okay then it is said he also sent a check to mahesh for the amount due after deducting his expenses along with the commission at 10 percentage on the gross sale proceeds okay so he sent a check to Mahesh, all the money which he received, that is 30,000, he sent a check to Mahesh after deducting his expenses. So all the expenses of consignee is paid by Mahesh, okay? Then along with the commission at 10%, that means consignee is getting a commission of 10% on the gross sale proceeds, okay? 10% on 30,000, okay? That is the sales, okay? Then it is said, Prepare the necessary ledger accounts in the books of Mahesh, the consigner. Okay, so we'll prepare three accounts. First one would be consignment account, and the second one would be the consignee account, and the third would be goods sent on consignment account. Okay, it is very easy. Okay, I will show you how to prepare all those three accounts. Okay, okay, okay. Now we'll prepare all the accounts in the books of Mahesh okay that is the consigner okay all right now consignment account consignment account is similar to trading and PNL account okay in consignment account we record expenses on debit side okay and revenues on credit side okay so consignment account is prepared to find out profit or loss made by the consignment okay so in this question first it is said that Ramesh sent the goods to Balaram okay so he had to purchase these goods before sending it on consignment okay so that purchase is an expense for Ramesh okay so expense we record it on the debit side of consignment account okay so here we will write this 20,000 okay 20,000 and we will write here two goods sent on consignment okay two goods sent on consignment okay next it is given here that Ramesh has incurred some expenses to send the goods okay like fret and insurance of 1,500 so this is also an expense for Ramesh okay so these expenses will also come on the debit side okay but here we will write here to cash okay we will not write to fret or to insurance because in consignment account we need to prepare limited number of accounts okay we need to prepare limited number of accounts so to prepare limited number of accounts we have to take here to cash okay and here under we will write fret and insurance 
okay that is 1500 equal to 1500 okay next here it is said that balaram that is the consignee has also incurred some expenses such as carriage of 300 and octroi of 200 okay so these expenses will also come on the debit side okay to balaram here we will write as to balaram not to cash okay because balaram is the person who incurred those expenses okay carriage of 300 and octroi of 200 okay equal to 500 okay now it is said balaram sold all the goods for 30000 okay so this is sales so sales so is it an expense or a revenue of course it is a revenue okay so all the revenues will come on the credit side okay so we will write here 30000 okay and here we will write by balaram because balaram is the person who sold all the goods okay sales okay now next here it is said that commission on sales that means balaram is entitled to a commission of 10 percentage on sales so commission is an expense for ramesh okay because ramesh has to pay the commission to balaram so that expense will come on the debit side okay and it will come as to balaram okay commission it is said commission of 10 percentage commission on sale 30000 okay so 10 percentage on 30000 is equal to 3000 okay is it right okay now we will balance this account and find out the balancing figure okay so credit side is bigger than debit side okay so we will write this 30000 on both sides 30000 30000 okay then we will subtract all this with 30000 okay and it will give us the balancing figure that is 5000 okay to profit and loss the profit will be transferred to profit and loss account okay easy right okay okay after preparing the consignment account we need to prepare the consignee account okay and this account is prepared to find out the amount due from the consignee okay amount due from the consignee okay all right so to prepare this account first you need to see the consignment account okay you have to see where the consignee name appears on the consignment account okay if it appears on the debit side then you have to credit it in the consignee account okay and if it appears on the credit side then you have to debit it in the consignee account okay so here balaram has appeared here on the debit side of consignment account so we will credit it over here as by consignment okay by consignment equal to 500 similarly it has appeared here also to balaram so here it is debited then here it will be here we will credit it okay by consignment 3000 rupees okay now balaram name has also appeared on the credit side of consignment account okay so we will debit it in the consignee account by consignment as by consignment okay by consignment 30000 all right okay then it is said in the question that balaram has paid an advance to ramesh of 10000 okay so that advance we will record it on the credit side of consignee account as by bank okay by bank 10000 okay it is given in the question okay then we will balance this account and find out the amount due from the consignee okay so debit side is bigger than the credit side okay so we'll write 30000 on both the sides 
okay 30,000 30,000 then we will subtract all these with the 30,000 and it is equal to 16,500 okay and it will be the balancing figure and we will write by bank okay it is a balancing figure okay easy right okay okay after preparing the consignment account and then the consignee account we need to prepare goods sent on consignment account okay so to prepare this account you need to see the consignment account okay and see where the goods sent on consignment appears in the consignment account okay in this problem it appears on the debit side okay so we will credit it over here okay as by consignment okay by consignment 20,000 okay and we will balance this directly okay we'll balance this we'll balance this account and here we will write to trading account okay we'll transfer this balance to trading account okay this is the balancing figure easy right okay okay at first we prepared the consignment account in the books of Mahesh okay and this account is prepared to find out the profit or loss made by the consignment okay and in this account all the expenses are recorded on the debit side and all the revenues on the credit side okay and we debited this to good cent on consignment because this was a expense for the consignment okay and similarly these expenses we recorded it as to cash because in consignment we always record the expenses of consigner as to cash okay similarly the consignee has also incurred some expenses so we recorded his expenses by his name as to balaram okay then we recorded his commission the commission of consignee as to balaram 3000 okay then balaram has sold all the goods so we recorded here on the credit side because sales is a revenue so we always record revenue on the credit side okay so we credited by balaram 30,000 because balaram was the person who sold all the goods okay okay then we balanced this account and found out the profit as 5,000 okay easy right okay okay after preparing the consignment account we prepared the consignee account okay and this account is prepared to find out the amount due from the consignee okay so to prepare this account first we saw the consignment account okay and whatever was credited over here by the name of consignee we debited it over here by the name of consignment okay and whatever was debited over here by the name of consignee we credited it over here by the name of consignment okay then we credited the bank advance the advance that was paid from the consignee to the consigner okay and then as a balancing figure we found out then as a balancing figure we found out as the amount due as 16500 okay easy right okay okay after preparing the consignment account and then the consignee account we prepared goods sent on consignment account okay and this two goods sent on consignment we credited it as by consignment okay then we balanced this account and found out the balancing figure as 20,000 okay and we transferred this balance to trading account okay easy right okay